morning dish. He's the hardest working man in show business. His band's music takes you into the midnight hours. And when you wake up, his voice is back on your radio alarm clock. How on earth did this happen? Well, Jeff saw me taking out the trash at the radio station. And he won another award. But this one is better. I'm your food it's the Morning Dish with the 2019 Radio Personality of the Year winner, Stephen Phillips. You paying attention to this, Packy? And Murphy's own Sherry Rains. Yeah, you must have given horseback passes to the right guy, Stephen. Well, giddy up. And Packy Smith's Shetland Pony is right alongside. You guys know these demo tapes don't just edit themselves together, right? Well, all right. Three cheers for Stephen Phillips. Y'all need to help Stephen Phillips out over there. Out the door and off the radio. Here's Stephen Phillips. All righty, folks, we're back with you. We got rolling in from Nashville, Tennessee, born in Tampa, Florida, raised in Houston, Texas. Uh, Will Van Winkle and the Six Pin. I don't think we got Six Pins with us, though. We just got Will, right? How you doing? I'm good, man. Wake up now. I know it's early up there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Seven thirty here. A little cold today too. Yeah, I know that's a daggum truth. I know how you 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 know all you rock stars, y'all play all night and sleep all day. But anyway, but but you were you yeah, were that's pretty much how it goes. It's, it's a little early for me yeah. right now, but yeah, you I'm hanging born, in. But now you were born in Tampa, Florida, man, and then raised in Houston, Texas. That's a big change. I mean, you going yeah, from like Ybor well, City out there to, to cows. Of course, Sherry, she's all about Houston because she's from Texas. I moved here from Houston. Yeah, I stayed up a little late last night watching the game. Uh, oh, who won? Because I, I made about that. Are you kidding? I didn't watch it. Who won? Tell us who won, Will. Well, it wasn't us. Oh, okay. ah, it was us. It wasn't Houston. It was us. I made everybody in North it was Georgia. You. Yeah, I made yeah. everybody in North Georgia. Rub man. it in. Yeah, yeah. the Braves, yeah. man. What are you going to do? They're going to take it all the way. Nah. All the way. Nah. Yeah. I don't know about that. We'll see what happens. Yeah, come on now. But now you got to be, you're closer to Georgia than you are Texas now, so you ought to start pulling for Georgia. Yeah, but you know, I got to go with where I grew up. Yeah, yeah. Now, you actually started in Florida, so there you go. You got Florida, and then you're in Nashville, so that's really that's two for one. Yeah, I moved out of Florida when I was three, though, so I don't know if I can count that. Yeah, I guess you're right. So, anyway, tell us a little bit about, uh, and I love Will, W-I-L, because, you know, I, I think people put too many letters in their names nowadays. You know, Will, Yeah, W-I-L. well, you know, I couldn't afford the second L, so I just kept it with one. Hey, I'm with you on that, and it pr- it's pronounced the same, you know? So. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, tell us a little bit about your story, man. I mean, you're uh, you're up there trying to struggling uh, musician like a, a lot right now, but uh, you got some good stuff out there. Let's hear what's going on. Yeah, uh, well, I mean, we're it's, it's a long story, so well, you better where, where would you like me to start? <laughs> Let, let's not start at age of three. I moved out of Tampa, Florida. Let's go a little further than that. Yeah, yeah, that's that's, that's a little young. Um, no, I mean, I, I. I um, I started doing music in Houston and did that for a while, moved overseas. I lived in the former Soviet Union, Germany, uh, traveled all over the U.S. I landed in Nashville and uh, put together the the six pins. Um, And then, uh, you know, we've just been playing around Georgia, Alabama, Tennessee, Kentucky, you know, we got a few other places in mind that we're looking to get into, right. and uh, we're just kind of trying to scratch out a name for ourselves right now. Well, I mean, you're making a dent, ain't no doubt. But of course, now you're on the morning dish, that might end your career. We have killed a few over the years being on the show, but anyway, hopefully it'll help. But uh, you've got some good stuff, <laughs> man. It's kind of you know, I guess it, uh, you know, it's it's country, but you know, you got the blues influence, I guess you would say on that. Yeah, well, we're, we're more of Americana, so we're somewhere in between country and rock, but you can hear, like, the blues influences. You can hear the, you know, there's one song that is straight up uh, a blues, bluegrass influence song with uh, a little bit of a rock flavoring in there, you know. So it, it goes a little bit one way sometimes, a little bit the other way the other times. Well, now, do you write your own stuff? I do most of the writing. Um we're taking most of November off to begin working on music for 2022. We did just release a new EP called the Diedrich Knickerbocker Diaries Volume 1. 
Um, wow, my say name that actually, again real my slow. last name actually is Van Winkle, so I'm kind of playing off the story of Rip Van Winkle when oh. I name some of these CDs. That's where they're the names are off the wall. The previous EP was a uh, perpetual club of sages, philosophers, and other idle personages. There's seven words in the title and five yeah. songs on the CD. These are so, songs yeah. that Steven will never cover. He's dyslexic. He can barely <laughs> read Dick and Jane. You'll never have to worry about him ruining one of your songs. I promise. There you go. <laughs> I like, I like songs that's wrote in one key, like the key <laughs> of A and just stays there. With <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> Come well, on, Will. Laugh, man. It's funny. You can relax. <laughs> He's tired. It's still a little early, and I'm still a little sour about that loss last night. So, <laughs> Well, hey, man, um, you think it's bad this morning. Wait till tomorrow. Uh, don't get too optimistic. <laughs> anyway, no, we do. Uh, we're we're going to be writing more as a group next month for uh, 2022 releases right. rather than just me um, doing my stuff. Right. Um. But usually when I do submit something to the song, to the band, they all have their input. It's not like I'm telling them exactly what to play. It's like, here's the basic, and then you all take it from there. Well, that's so where the everybody's good, that's got where their the, input, input. Yeah, that's where the good music comes from when everybody, because, you know, like I say, they got their own bass beat, you know, for the bassist, and he kind of knows where to go with that. I think that's the way, instead of going into a studio and setting it up and say, oh, guys, this is the way we're going to play it. I just think it's, uh, I think it's better to do that, let the band get involved. Well, yeah, and everybody's got their own influences. Like our bass player, Alan Atkinson, is really into like Molly Hatchet and, oh, yeah. and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And our drummer was a big Journey fan. Right. So, you know, they're bringing in all these influences from different places. And I have no idea what I like. I'm kind of schizophrenic on, on that area. Right. Um, so they're able to change up maybe what would have been one way and then they come in with their influences and they do other things and you know we just got a brand new guitar player he came to us from austin he's from uh oklahoma though right and we haven't gotten a chance to record with him yet so we're looking forward to that because uh his name's zach mears he's a phenomenal guitar player right folks so y'all that's tuning in we're talking to will van winkle and the six pins, and uh, you can go to www. Dot, which is the worldwide well vanwinkle. Dot band. I think that's your website, right? That is it. Vanwinkle. Dot band. So now you're out. You're actually touring right now, which is a good thing. Uh, where are you going to be in the next few days? Well, we're winding down 2021 with a few more club dates. Um, our next place that we're going to be playing is the Moose Lodge in Paris, Tennessee. Right. And then we've got. Twin Kegs 2 in Nashville. And then I think we're doing uh, New Year's Eve out of VFW in Dover, Tennessee. Yeah. I love Paris. I'd like to go up to Paris and take a picture of that. What is that called? The Eiffel Tower? Ain't that where it's at in Paris, Tennessee? Uh, I've really only There's seen the Paris, Texas. The, the I think Moose it's Lodge. probably in Paris, Texas. It's Paris, Texas. Okay. Yeah. yeah. You got it confused. Wrong yeah. state. I knew Steven. it was Paris something. But anyway. <sighs> All right, Will, we got to get to break, man. I appreciate you calling down and, and sharing your music. I, I do enjoy your stuff, no doubt about it. Tell them again one time uh, or one more time how do they can get up with you and where they can follow you and uh, maybe buy some of your music and uh, T-shirts and all that good stuff. All right. Uh, well, you know, you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, at Will Van Winkle and the Six Pins. Uh, Will only has one L. Like I said, I couldn't afford the second one. Or our webpage, vanwinkle.band. We're all over most streaming uh, – most streaming services, but, you know, listen to the radio show first and then check us out. There you go. Will, I sure do appreciate you, man. We'll keep up with you and see what's going on in the future. Maybe we'll get to play together sometime. That'd be great. All right, good deal, man. Listen, you take care. Go back to bed. Yeah, yeah. that's kind of the plan. Yeah, <laughs> and and in the morning, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send you a text in the morning when, when the Braves win again. Uh, you don't ever want to talk to this guy again, again I'll send you a text. How's that? <laughs> <laughs> All right, man, you take care. All right, you have a good one. Thank you. Bye, bud. Hey, before Thank you for spending a little time with us. And remember, you can tune in every morning at WJULradio.com at 8 a.m. Eastern. And please subscribe to our YouTube channel and like us on Facebook, The Morning Dish.